And now the real paranoia begins. Where I beg and hope and dream that everything works nicely. But you can never tell. But yes, hello. It is I, Neon Icy Wings. And I got Kirby and the Forgotten Land for my birthday. Because this stream is sponsored by my mom! Literally, because she, she bought it for my birthday, because she is a lovely lady. And so, also, yes, I downloaded the demo, and then never played it. That's depression for you. But either way, let's just jump on in, play some Kirby in the Forgotten Land. Have the nice dopamine serotonin that a Kirby in it inevitably gives upon the lives of people. Be like Kirby. Be carefree, nice, and if somebody eats your cake, murder them. Would you like to connect online? This will allow you to make your gameplay information visible to other players. While I don't even have the Nintendo Online, so there's no real point to doing it, so I guess no. The setting can be changed later. Thank you. Select a difficulty mode. Wild mode. A Kirby game that's a bit wilder and more challenging. This adventure will be tough sometimes, but you'll collect a lot of star coins as rewards. And then bree spring breeze mode. I like that. I always like it when they b b partially, s smallly reference other Kirby games. They do that a lot, and I, I appreciate that. A Kirby game that's simple to play. You'll have a lot of health for this adventure. I'll go with wild mode. Beat my ass, Kirby. <laughs> I always love Popstar. Looks crazy. Look at the fidelity. Look at the happy Kirby. He's just so beautiful and wonderful. This kind of makes me want to go play Star Allies again. If I was less depressed, I might have replayed Star Allies in preparation for this game. It's not like they're going to be connected, but it's just like, hey, I'll do it. And once again, the world of uh, Popstar is terrorized <laughs> by just existing. Epic music as usual. Ah, Spear Waddle Dee. The Waddle Dee we all know and love. Look at the fidelity, I love it. The music, everything's beautiful. Man, living on Popstar in the Kirby universe is like living in New York in the Marvel universe. Hey, look, it's like all the things that you can vor in this game. Because that's a gameplay mechanic. Vor. Granted, it's Kirby. It's always been the gameplay mechanic. But you know, memes. Oh, no. It's Legend of Kirby. Uh, what's the one where Link sh sh shipwrecks onto a beach and it's all a dream? Kirby's like, ah, a jungle. I've never seen this before. Granted, this does seem a lot more... <gasps> and we just ride into it. But one second, the cat wants to leave the room because whenever I close my door to sit down and do these, my cat is always just like, okay, now I want to leave. When I try to leave the room, he comes rushing in. When I want to stay in the room, he's like, ah, let me out. And also, when he tries to come in, when I'm trying to pack up my room for the night, he rushes in to make sure that I can't leave. When he wants out, very slow. All right. I already got key. Look. How do I swallow? That's not something you want to hear. Oh, 
come to me. Oh, he didn't want to. Ah, it's the... Ah, it's the... We're going back to guarding. One second, I'm just going to mess with my TV settings. Because it's just way too bright. Trying to find the right balance on this goddamn TV. Pain and misery. That's what it is. You're just like, I want to see things, but I don't want to be blinded. We'll go with that and pray for the best. Now let's go into the wide world of Kirby. What's this? A flower? How is this the first uh, actual like 3D 3D Kirby game? I mean, besides uh, the ever all known Kirby Air Ride. I know that there was like supposed to be like a GameCube 3D Kirby game, but it, 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 did the rocks run away from me? I feel like the rocks ran the hell away from me. Also, this reminds me. Apparently there was, like, a game journalist article. Because, of course, there's just like, Ugh, Kirby has a hard mode. I hate that. Games journalists, when a game doesn't have... A game select like difficulty selection, they piss their pants. But when an easy game has a hard mode, suddenly no. How dare they? How could they do this? Only easy mode. Because they're all psychopaths. And hello, it's the it's the future of Earth in five years for a multitude of reasons. Ah, oh, the music. Hello, Blade Knight. Nom. Ah, you don't have to... You don't even have to do the whole swallow. Be gone, Mushroom Man. Also, doesn't this game have that nifty feature where even if you don't actually hit an enemy in the 3D space, if you, it looks like in the camera that you did? that you'll actually hit it. I find that nice. It'd be kind of funny. I wanted to see if there was like a... I have to get used to the controls. Oh, aha. There we go. Because for some reason, you know, when you stop playing Nintendo games for a hot minute, you're like, why is this the jump button? Something cola. At least it looks like cola. Hey, heal! It finally looks like a drink. In all the other thi all the other games, it kind of looks like I don't know a battery cylinder of God. Ah, you, you rolly bombs! I am the real bomber man. Me? Bomber man has been missing for five billion years. It doesn't look like you have self-destruction from the bombs. And you can just, like, five billion bombs all over the place. Platforming might be a little bit weird because my brain abhors camera angles. I can't read that. Yo! Something. Into the E.O. Oh, we go. I lost my hat! No! Zero out of ten. My hats don't come into the cutscenes. Oh no. The cute animals are here to kill you, Kirby. 
You know, if that's able to bring the car in, that really should just collapse the entire building from how strong the suction is. Kind of like how in the Goku Black arc of Dragon Ball Super, all of their punches should be eradicating the planet. But no, we, we have to say that all the characters are super strong, but never show it. These characters are super multiversal godbusters, but when they punch each other into buildings, the building doesn't disintegrate. I'll never understand power scalers. I got lots of loot. I died. Uh, okay, I didn't die. I, my hat's on the car! I just realized that. I could be a Pizza Hut driver if I wanted. I wonder how many secrets there are. Is there a secret over here? No. I want to know. Are there secrets? How many secrets are there? Will this Kirby duel the 5D's Yu-Gi-Oh! man? If Kirby swallowed one of the Yu-Gi-Oh! protagonists, what would his power be? Of course, it's music. <laughs> and then Kirby, he's just vibing. Really? Is this like a Splatoon fake language? Or I assume because it has the same Kirby fake language letters down there. A place where all you'll all laugh and smile. You know, Apocalypse. Then again, Kirby has gone to Future Earth before. Hello, Purple Fire Kitty. Woo me indeed. <laughs> I didn't expect an opening music, like, not music video, but like... I, I, I'm just <laughs> kind of shocked by this for some reason. So intrigued, Kirby is just vibing as a car through the post-apocalypse while a pop song is being played. It's not a mess. And hello, the Phantom. This is just utterly hilarious to me. And oh no, Kirby's vibing has been interrupted. <laughs> Kidnapping is occurring. Kirby Fallout Edition. And Kirby's just like, oh, I can't jump that. Or maybe he's out of gas. Kirby needs to eat more bean burritos. Once again, forgetting what the jump button is because I haven't played a Nintendo game in like a week. I'm glad I come into Kirby while I edit a Dan birthday gift. Huzzah! The perf- the- the perfect- the perfect podcast to listen to. Kirby. Oh no, the wildlife is- the wildlife mafia is kidnapping Waddle Dees. Birdcage airdrops with frickin' hound hunter squads? Okay, the galaxy is in your eyes. You are either a lovable friend or a horrific monster. Considering they have a giant cage for you, I can only assume you're an evil monster and they need to contain your power. <laughs> Seriously, why do you get the big one? The Waddle Dees are bigger than you. Let go of the child. Let go of the child. I have bombs. Bomberman hasn't had a 3D video game in 5 billion years. I must suffice. Let go. I release the demon. The notched wing ear is a, a cute detail. Kirby sees animals in danger. Comes to kill. 
<laughs> he saved me. Thank you. But what about those other guys? The Waddledees? They were all captured and taken away. We fought those beasts as hard as we could, but they kept coming back for more. Now I'm the only one left. I have to go save them. I have to. Don't worry, this is Kirby, Eldritch Abomination Annihilator. <laughs> I'm editing music for the video. I decided to do something I haven't done in a minute. Neat. What? You'll help me save everyone? That's great. So, your name is Kirby? Kerbal, Kerbal. Elfillin. Elfillin. Sounds a lot like elf villain. <laughs> I'm elf. I'm Elfillin. Nice to meet you. Please be a nice friend that I can love and cherish. Hey, Kirby, who is this? Ah, it's Waddle Dee. Co op with two players, but sadly, I am alone. <laughs> Select play co op from the pause menu to have player two control Bandana Waddle Dee work together by playing together. Boy, am I glad to see you. I got pulled through that vortex over planet Popstar, too. If you ever want a second player to join you, just let me know. I'll always be ready. Too bad I am not. But okie doke to the world map, Elphalon. My cutesy friend, who I beg please be a cutesy friend forever. As much as I love Marx as a bad guy, I want friendship. Besides, we have sexy hip cat to get to one of these days. I don't know where, I don't know when, but I do know I am interested. Can I go over to this island? You can search. I knew it. Come on, Kirby, let's go save those poor captured Waddle Dees. Clear the stage, save the hidden Waddle Dees. There are missions! Yay! I am excited. I decided to do a song cover of his favorite song, and I'm going to take photos and art of him to use in the video. Super neat. Makes it all the more personal, makes it a good gift. Downtown Grassland. With hidden Waddle Dees. Are they hidden behind the camera? No, they are not. Time to kill the hunter squads. My brain was just like, hmm, I want to make a, like a, a Kakashi joke because his Zanbu mask is abound, but I don't know. Hey, it's Cutter Man. He will have to die one of these days. <laughs> make five tulips bloom five times. Neat. I shall do. Be gone, rabbit. Vile rabbit abomination. Can. You can jump all you want, you're gonna die one of these days. I love the music. It's nice, light, and fun. They locked up the cake. Why did they lock up the cake? What did the cake ever do to you? I can't see. I'm in the dungeon. But I did make a tulip blossom. That's what's important. Yeah, ironically, this video got me to look up a song I've never heard of before. That's always fun, finding new music. Oh no. We can mouthful the giant. We must become capitalism. <laughs> you have 99 sodas. I've got 99 sodas. This rabbit isn't one. There it Aiming and firing is difficult. The soda is so powerful, it destroys cans. And you can pick them back up? Neat. The destruction, the destructive power of soda. Fear it! That, that amuses me greatly for some reason. Kirby can't go through there on his own natural means. He must destroy them with soda. What's that? A pop capsule? Reminds me of, uh, wasn't there an episode of, like, the Kirby anime, Kirby right back at you, surrounding, uh, 
uh, like little pop capsule figurines. Oh, I can't even go there with it. I must abandon my capitalistic ventures. Can I follow you? I have no idea where it went. <laughs> I did! I saw he hit me as I swallowed. What? The utter magic of madness. But now I feel like I have to go through the the level again. Did I miss any tulips? Wait. I had to make sure. Was that just the distortion of the vortex of Kirby? Or was that rubble actually moving? I can't tell sometimes. Because I'm just in utter amazement of this game. Hello. I swallow you. And then I spit you out. Oh yeah. Uh, my brain just... My brain going over like a level that is five seconds. Did I miss anything? I am secret obsessed when it comes to some games. Because I fear. Because I. Could I, I had to have missed something. I had to. I'm a, I'm a dumb dumb. Kirby is amazing. That is indeed. Kirby is an amazing series. Utterly fantastic. Stupid mushroom man! You will be devoured for your insolence. Your power is now mine. Bomber man. Good to know that classic Kirby obstacles, the cannons still exist, even though, really, they don't really pose that much of a threat. Not as much in, as, as in 2D. Oh no, the cones. Can we destroy? I don't think we can. Nope. We need the cones. Get a mouthful of this cone. I want one of the target Kirby's. One of the target Kirby's. I do not know. My brain. Oh, maybe... Are there... Uh, I have fallen... That reminds me. I have very much fallen out of uh, the know when it comes to, like, amiibos. Then again, that, my brain just kind of shuts off in a lot of ways. It's just like... A lot of things go on in the world. And my brain's just like, ah. Frozen peas. Die, pound squads of doom. Can I destroy this rock? I cannot destroy the rock, but I can destroy the ground. I'm almost 400 Kirby coins richer. Be gone, Buffalo Man. Your hunter squads will not hunt me. Why is there a... Oh, I, I thought it was on a barrel. It's in a barrel. There is a vast difference. I'll DM you an image. Huzzah! Even though this is just a... Uh, the, what's it? The... Uh, tutorial stage. I'm liking it. I can't wait for the game to potentially get hard and annihilate me. I got another pop capsule. I can't wait to see what that actually is. The wonders of uh, discovery. Ah, the target ball Kirby's. Oh yeah. I forgot that they wrapped the target red balls that are outside of tar Target stores with Kirby faces. They look weird, but at the same time, oddly lovely. Let's get cutting up the enemies into doom. You can try to jump banani me, but I will cut you up. Wild Edge. You don't really look like a Kirby. I don't know what you look like. You look like a demon. Die. Die, Satan. You will be annihilated. He's angry. Cool. That's the wall. Come on, my dude. <gasps> I defeated Melania. Sword of Mikula. I can defeat you. I just get the sword. That works for me. Let go of the boy. Friendship attained. 
I wouldn't call that a hidden waddle dee, but I guess they get more hidden in the future. I want one. It would be amusing to have, but at the same time, I would be feared that my target Kirby could be used as a murder weapon. Ow. I have failed. It destroyed my power! I devour you! Well, it didn't destroy. I just didn't see it behind his giant dump truck. How dare you hit me? I now kill you and devour your carrots. That looks disturbing, is it? I was gonna say eel, but no, that is an, uh, a, a turtle of demons. Or maybe it's a turtle eel. The horrifics. Pu the horrific pu Oh no, it's a hungry, hungry turtle demon. Nice to know. Oh, I need that. I need a. I need a cone. I need a cone to destroy you. I will get a cone. And then your safety will no longer be so safe. You hear me? You little ugly man. You ugly man, man. Wait, nope. Right back. I said get back. Hey, respawns. Good. This is a kind tutorial level. I need to approach him properly. I got excited with my potential for murder. Oh. They hid a certain waddle be inside of him. This really is the Kirby game of war. There has to be something for all these, uh, these cans, or maybe they're just money. Either way, give. For I am Kirby, F Forgotten Wonderland, Entrompreneur, how do you say it? I've never been good at saying that word. I turn into the, the Swedish chef from Muppets. I hate that guy. I always hit him, but he always hits me. It is a vile horror of the world. I have scared away the butterflies. All is right in the world. And the birds! Twitter has been defeated. He knocked me off. I'm coming up, Billy! It's a stealth section! Look of the Metal Gear! Help me, Billy! I'm being attacked by a giant turtle! Colonel, I'm being attacked by a giant turtle that's wearing a barracks on its back. Look out, Snake. Its power is too great. It can even rival Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Impossible. Remember to stay hydrated <laughs> while you destroy giant building turtles. Die. So... Elfman is like worth three Waddle Dees. All in all, not that bad. Let's see. Break the building shutter. Oh, I got that. I missed a hidden Waddle Dee! What? Oh, it's such a short level. I believe those are called Tex Rex. How did I miss a hidden? How did I miss a hidden? Kirby. Kirby was pulled into a mysterious vortex that appeared in the sky over his home on planet Popstar. When he woke up, he was in a new world. Traveling through that vortex also gave Kirby a new mysterious power. Swallowing things. A little bit. Let's see what it can do. Onward to adventure. Bronto Bird. Uh, I, I, did, I, was, did I not wait long enough? Or can I not read these? Oh, I, I guess the three stars. They have words. <laughs> I can help you find it if you want. Oh, thank you for the ha uh, the offer. If I <laughs> if if Kirby truly stumps me, I will endeavor to ask. 
car shop sign. This logo belonged to an auto shop named Holine Cust Holine 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 Custom Autos, part of the Holine Corps. Holine also sold industrial parts, managed construction, and made all kinds of stuff. From buildings to streets to amusement park rides, remember, if it's quality, it's Holine. Uh, perhaps it was would be more accurate. I'm just shocked I actually missed a thing. Through the tunnel. Bye, Waddle Dees. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna try. Your figure collection is now available. Use this to view all the figures you've collected. See if you can collect a full set. I'm gonna see. So it's between the first one, at least they have that. I can only help on the first level as I have only played the demo. Ah, makes sense. Okay, but at least we can kind of rush through. We don't have to do too much. We're just looking for a, for a hidden waddle to do dee 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 dee. It's not that big of a deal dee 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 deal. How dare you outrun me, Tiki Man! Did the box hit me? Ah, oh, it looks like you can inhale the big object without dropping your cur- What? Really? Approach the object, press B to give it a try? Really? Ah! Huh. I am a dumb. Thank you, Elflin! You are a helpful ally! Be gone, Satan. We shall explore. Find the hissing, the hissing. Seeing a Waddle Dee hiss would be disturbing. But seeing the missing Waddle Dee, see if we can find the boy. It's after the obligatory hey, here. And plus we can pad our, our, our collection stats. I guess I didn't hit the proper thing. I have to get... <laughs> you didn't collect all the coins. We can't make the stairway. That amuses me for some reason. Interesting. Well, that's... have lots of help. That will also help me come to... I guess come to terms how the many things in the game work. Give me a refresher course in the tutorial that I just tutorialed. <laughs> Just need to get the first Waddle Dee. The first Waddle Dee will then be our gauge. Basically, comb everything to high hell. It's after the boss fight, but before the end of the level. Which isn't a lot, but still. Oh, but I'm dumb. I forgot. We just had this conversation with Alphalin! <laughs> We just had it. And my brain is just like, oh no, if I want to swallow thing, I have to get rid of current thing. Because brain is dumb. Brain is silly. Brain is fool. As full as Kirby's mouth is right now. Which I know sounds impossible. Just look at the abomination boy. I wonder if there's gonna be a boss fight that's solely going to be in mouthful mode. probably do a lot of damage. And plus, we get tons of currency out of this. Because you know, that's what I need to do. Grind the Kirby game. But oh, how magical it can be. And then after we defeat the boss... We will have to take a look around. Aha! We actually get currency for it. It'd be kind of... It would be kind of funny. I have bombs. Bombs for everyone. Take this, sword man. Try and hit me all you want. Bombs. Bombs from behind. 
the true bummer man experience. Oh no, he's angry. I shall run around you. I can run circles around you. Big bird man wearing a suit. A hoot suit? A hoot and suit. I think I know which one you're missing. That would be epic. That would be epic to something. I don't know. I say so many things, I forget what I've said. Binges. Wait. I didn't go... Wait, did I go up there? I don't think I went up there. Me dumb. Me very dumb. Die, Buffalo Man. The motto might be, I ain't messing with you, but I am. Ha! Huh. Oddly disturbing. <laughs> I, I, I could I have missed you. You were so obvious, but my brain saw other things like, I shall go over there. And I, nope, it'd be amusing if I could blow you up with a bomb. Unconventional. It would mean having to keep the bomb power up all the way to here, and I think that would be amusing. Understandable why not, but still. Enter into my vortex of doom. And now that we've learned, I can wield a sword and be a cone. Have you ever seen a cone wield a sword? It's a magical experience. And we're gonna have to get rid of but actually no, we need you. Be dumb. My brain is trying to sabotage itself. Why would, why would there even be a sign saying, hey, go up? It's the post-apocalypse. Did they advocate for parkour? Hey, parkour people. It's acting like that one's special. Anyway, I shall take this one instead. It... Then again, the one I just had disappeared. That's the more magical one. <laughs> yep, you found it. My brain is just too active. My brain wants to go too many different directions, so the, the side direction is like, oh yeah, I need to go there someday. I don't. Silly turtle. You are a being of your own demise. Then again, I am destroying infrastructure. Now die. That is so brutal. And then the birds are just like, here, take the coins, just leave us alone. I'm being bribed by the enemy. And now we've perfected, cleared in wild moan, and eaten wild, wild moan. Brain, is there something you want to say? Ah, Bandana D. Bandana Waddle D was pulled through the vortex along with Kirby. When he heard that his fellow Waddle Ds were being captured by the Beast Pack, he grabbed his trusty spear and ran to help. He can join you as player two while you explore the new world. <laughs> Trapped Waddle Ds. Captured Waddle Ds. The Beast Pack managed to catch these three Waddle Ds with one golden cage. If they work together, they might be able to. Oh, never mind, they're too sad to move. All they can do is cry out for help. <laughs> Somebody save them! That's depressing. <laughs> Ow, I smacked my phone into my nose. I hate when that happens. And that has been cleared. Up, there was a search. Search! Give me coins. Give me coins. Is this a level or can I just go there? It's hard to tell. There's a giant bone structure over there. I'm scared. Clear the stage. Save four hidden waddledees and three unknown objectives. Through the tunnel. Ooh, fire people. This is good music. For some reason, it kind of reminds me of uh, 
some of the music for Fighting is Magic. At least that initial violin part. At least that was violin. The mushroom people want to be smoked. Oh great, now it's super dark. On my TV at least. Now I have to recalibrate my goddamn TV. I really, really need to recalibrate my TV's colors one of these days. Basically, whenever I want to know, is my TV screwed up or is it meant to be this way? I just look at my output capture. <laughs> On OBS, it's like, OBS wouldn't lie to me. I hope. Because it felt like the... The, uh, what is it called? The beach felt a little bright, but then I entered the cave and it was super dark. I'm like, oh no. That was an enemy? Or is it? No, it's not an enemy. It's just a... Uh, at least maybe it was. I don't know. I destroy it. That's a thing. Fire is pretty. Yeah. Actually. Yeah, the music. This music in particular is... Like... Like my nostalgia, I think. I don't even know why. Die, beast pack. Die, tiki man. I shall unlock this holder. Fight me if you dare. I am Flame Frother. They're actually making noises in the cage. Why would you put a cage in a box? Yes, we already put this Waddle Dee in a cage. Throw him in a treasure chest. Man, this beast pack. Or sadists. Come on, they're kerosene. These look like blow upables. So they should blow up, but they don't. But yeah, this violin section really hits me in my nostalgia because it kind of reminds me of Twilight Sparkle's stage. Oh, yeah, well, Twilight Sparkle's theme and fighting is magic. It feels like I should have found the Waddle Dee by now. Maybe they're over here. I know! Kirby's dying! Ah! I overestimated his ability to fly. This is not one of your 2D Kirby games. In this one, he can die. Wait, what? It looked like there was something, like, in the void for some reason. Oh, uh, well. We shall go through the door, even though I feel like I've missed well, poor Waddle Dee by now. We'll have to wait and see. I shall destroy the fire people with fire. It would be like if Aang beat the Fire Lord with firebending. Okay, two lanterns right next to each other. No, that really is making me feel like I'm missing things left and right. My paranoia is going through the roof. I'm back down, you wall. You have aperture science like wall. Portal, but with Kirby, would be an interesting thing. GLaDOS trying to comprehend this eldritch abomination before her. She tries to taunt Kirby, but Kirby cares not. keeps trying to insult Kirby. Kirby is just like, no, I don't care. I exist. 
I need. I like that the optional uh, objective thingies are like, hey, here's how you get to the thing. I probably would have looked around a lot for that one. Okay, good. We're on track. So long as we know that, we know we're on track. I've never ran track in my life, come to think of it. It feels like there's a second floor to this place. That's why the... Oh, look at it. Ow. Projectiles hurt. But I am a projectile. Can I put, fire this coal, or is it just bags of rocks? I knew it. I see coiled rope. I'm like, uh-huh. Cannon time. I shall free the secret Waddle D. Now we're super on track. The last ones will be in the actual boss fight, I believe. Well, boss scenario into the level get is what I assume. Find the secret room, which I guess I've done. Light the four lanterns, which I've done. And now hidden thing. Hmm. Okay, sandcastle Tiki Man. Die, Tiki Man, die. <laughs> what? Kirby has become... Stairs. What? I am Kirby. I am become Stare. What? <laughs> I'm just trying to process this. What even? I want to see. Can I climb into a new realm? Nope. That would be a, a, a later level thing to do. Have you have to maneuver the Kirby stair into a specific area to actually access a hidden place. That's totally what they would do. But this one's more obvious. Hey, go up there. Okay. Now the question is, is this the way they want us to go? I like the, hey, this is a mouthful object DVD they do. The color. I just like it. I don't know. It's, there's something about it. Something ethereal, void like. I like it. But now we must go. Flop like a fish. Die. No Kirby. This makes me think that, uh. It's a hint. It was not a hint. It's just a Kirby. Or maybe I can burn it. Remove the wanted post. I was right. I knew it. I am a smart person. I'm going to have to find the original soundtrack online and listen to it. As much as Nintendo wants to be like, no, park it from... <sighs> I knew it. I was going to comment. I wonder if having the stairs on the fuse would actually get in the way. And it does. Hey. Kirby, me do thing. I correct it. Darn you, Kirby. Oh, that's why this is here. And then I assume that's the way they want me to go. So, which is the optional path? The one, the cannon? Or I guess we can always go back. Nope, this is a pipe to a new area. So we go cannon. Wait. That's... Why is there a ladder up there? I assume it's connected to the, the cannon, but still. But that amuses me. That having the stairs on the fuse actually stops the fuse from going. I like that. It's simple, but I like it. Hand over the Waddle Dee! 
And look at the fidelity of the Kirby chests! It's wonderful! The fact that that's like a scarred stone there kind of makes me feel like, huh? Makes me feel like uh, perhaps I can go in there. It's destroyable, but it's not. Now up the pipe we go. I burn. I barely killed a turkey in there. Also known as a chicken. Wow, that could, he was worth a giant coin. Good for him. Boss fight? No. Just give. And then they are the boss fight. I just realized, this is gonna be like the first time, like in a really long time, that like, Waddle Dees aren't the, the mooks that are destroyed. They are who we must save. We got a Cappy. We got a Sir Kibble. And we rescued all of them. At least I think so. We completed all the challenges. We'll have to see what game says. Did we get all ten? We got all ten. All Waddle Dees saved. Hell yeah. Well, that's not... That's... What? The Waddle Dees you saved found a new mysterious area. Treasure Road. There could be rare items in there. Hop in and explore. What do you mean, rare items? I haven't even bought anything. Cutter treasure. Throw and catch treasure collecting. Difficulty one star. Target time one minute. Well, I've got a minute to spare. Give me all the puzzle pieces, Gandhi. Not great. We are in the shifting area. This kind of reminds me of like the VR missions in Metal Gear Solid Rising Revengeance. I don't know why. That music, like that guitar. Utterly magical. Oh no, peace give. This guitar man. Utterly musical. Eh. <laughs> My brain is like, go for diagonals, it never works. Screw you, Kibble. I got the star crystal. Whatever this is. And I beat the time at least, and I got 50 more coins. And I cleared it in wild mode. Or as my brain calls it, wild mode. Right. I don't even know what that is. But obviously it's important to unlock the Eldritch Abomination true boss at the end of the game. Triple strike bowling for switches. I get it, because it's on Switch, and we're probably going to be hitting Switches with it, but... In this day and age... For a moment there, I was going to say, good god, did I actually miss that? See ya, Mr. Bomb Boy! Get out of here. I am the bomb boy. <laughs> I am the bomb boy. Did I do it in 29 seconds? I think I do. 28.5! The perfect score. And onwards we go words. I like that transition screen. 
I wonder what they do. We'll probably never know. <laughs> and then we just find another one! You found a hidden portal to a treasure road! Lol. Free! Free! Burst and rise, a path full of pipes! Apparently this is a three difficulty. I am horrified. Is it platforming difficult? I think it's mostly platforming difficult. Oh, that actually worked. Okay. Yes, I know. I know. I am running low. Why is it so- I fell! I want to try again. The game was rude. Pushed me off. Darn me. Why is there a lip? I hate that. Fell into the void of doom. Good for them. I am aware. What, 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 what? I got knocked out of the water pipe zone. At least I got to the end. I didn't get the extra 50 coins, but those are negligible. Ah, target time was 45 seconds anyway. It was two seconds off. Darn me, Buffalo! <laughs> but now we have three of those. Whatever they do. Ah, oh, we can even search this. Another one. Another one. How many treasure roads are there this early on? Vending machine. shall annihilate all in my path. Destroy. Yeah. Destroy. Oh, and I have, like, unlimited ammo. Technically. Never stop shooting. Never stop killing. They killed me! Vile dictator Kirby has met with his end by his own hand. Never stop shooting, and then his own men shot him. Still, this guitar is amazing. Out of the way! Out of the way, animal boys! Time to destroy some buffalo. Die, buffalo. I am the Kirby machine. I am the Kirby Terminator. I actually got the bonus time. That is absurd. Why is the code so much harder? <laughs> it's like the designers. Yeah, and then this one will be like that, and this one will be like that. And what about the cone level? Murder them. The designer of the, the, the that one level, the cone level, just woke up and chose violence. They decided, no, we, we we want you to suffer. We want you. We want you to pain for you. When will I get to spend my cold earned cash of murder? What? Oh. Spiky ball. 
Eh? Spiky boy, come to me! Spiky time! <laughs> I'm like a horrifying sea urchin. Fear me. No. There was gun! Gun. I want wield gun. Bread? French bread. 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 Time for gun! Eat snacks off stump. That's not a healthy thing to do. Kirby coming in with his <laughs> his, his Glock. Time. Nom. Gun. Gun. <laughs> it's like that one gif. Kirby with an Uzi. Bang, 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 bang. I dare you, I want you to shoot. <laughs> Kirby becomes a sniper! Kirby is a horrifying assassin! <laughs> I don't know why, it's just the idea of Kirby having a gun. I'm the gun! Aw, but I shoot the ground. I'm gonna die. Mr. Spielberg, please. Shit. Maybe I can shoot it from a safe distance. After we shoot this guy. Or maybe it's just shoot that. Well, what do you know? It was shoot the thing and not the thing. It was shoot the locking mechanism, not the door. <laughs> Kirby would not survive as Indiana Jones. He sees a giant rock, he just sees a friend. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Mountain. Slam! I'm sorry, Mr. Mountain. Give me all the coins. All the coins. I gotta monopolize all the coins. Coin! Bang. It's a diamond. I don't trust it. My gun. Better than your gun. You know why? Ah, this is a door that I can return from. I hope. I was right. Yes. Apparently he wants me to be a gunman. You know, if you just randomly decided to not have your gun with you. After using it to get in the door. I missed that one. I'm a failure. Oh no! I somehow did it! Even though I suck! I didn't realize that the things were actually slowly falling until I'd done the top ones and they're like, oh no, they're almost all the way back down! I'm a failure! I am not that observant. Or at least my memory is. my immediate memory is trash. Trash garbage. Gun. Come on, it's the biggest. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. It's the biggest stump in the world! Is there, is there gonna... Oh, I thought we were gonna go up there. Apparently not. Follow me. Set me free. Follow me and we'll escape from the city. Not really, it was very slow. Also, that was nowhere near as, like, horrifying as... I forget which game it was. Either Robobot or Ultra Diddly D, where frickin' the Waddle Dee Sphere of Death Uh, he's supposed to be shot to death. Be shot. Be dead. Die. <laughs> People who do drugs go to hell and then die. Thank you, Mario, for teaching me morals about sending people to hell before they die. Wow. 
This giant car saved this Waddle Dee. Why can't you? Choo choo. Oh, I thought I was gonna release the Doom. No, the Doom be released on me. I missed two. I missed bloody two? Oh, okay, never mind. There was one there. I missed one before the blah, blah, blah. I don't think I can go all the way back. Ah, well, at least we've got all but one. I can replay that another time, this level another time. I am a failure. Oh, find the side road while going uphill. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Thank you for at least telling me after I beat the level once. That's actually a really good system. You have hidden things, and then once you go through the level once, if you don't find the hidden things, they're just like, okay. You have earned the knowledge of the thing. I actually really like that system. It seems basic, but it seems good. All right, so. Fire treasure. We're gonna fire that treasure. Get a new job. Fast and fiery. Race to the can. And you have to actually destroy the things that'll stop it from going. Nice. Oh, cool. They actually stop the thing while you're going. And now we just need to wait. I'm in the cannon. Watch me do the cannon dance. The ominous music is actually... I've been fired. Cannon time. Give me the key to the city. Rare stone found. I mean, I went into a giant fissure looking for it. It's not really rare. I've, I found like five of them already. What even do they do? Alphalan? Do you know? Are you not... What are you not telling me, elf villain? Wait. Okay, I was just like, it's, that's the difficulty, not the amount of stars there are in there. Stupid brain. The crystal stars. Is zero three going to become a reality? That actually worked. Hit the wall. Darn. Darn! I tried to be like, ah. And then I failed. I am the fail. I love the electric guitar in these areas. Like, Kirby music has got to be like the best genre of all time. And I still got the time on that. How? I missed so many shots. I get it. It's a Kirby game. I almost have 1996. Wonderful year. I don't know. I, well, I wasn't there. Now we have six of these things. What do they do? I want to know. 
a trip to a live a <laughs> trip to a live mall. No, Alavel Mall. Alivel. Alavel. Alavel. Do not go to Alavel. <laughs> Episode five. Kirby goes to the mall. Secret challenge. Kirby spends too much at the mall. Love the music. Get off that escalator. Episode six. Kirby vandalizes the mall. Die. 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 You thought you were safe inside the mall? It's day of the Kirby dead. Hey, Snake, are you in there? Love the music. Once again, the horns are reminding me of Fighting His Magic's music. seem to do any damage, but they still hit me. It's very mean. I got ice cream. More coins. More coins. Die. All of you will die. Saying it because it's true. I just feel like people who do Kirby music are just like, yes, I can do Kirby music. The most magical kind of music of all. Because you can basically do anything in a. <gasps> the Lollipop of Doom! Lollipop of Doom! You're all doomed. The lollipop is activated. Your fate is sealed. <laughs> Death to all betrayers. The bunny rabbit has come to avenge his friends. I will not give him the chance. Die. I shall raid your lockers. And there's nothing you can own. Oh, never mind. I'm going to become your lockers. I'm leaning. I'm leaning. I'm leaning as much as I can. I have to kind of maybe. <laughs> Okay, go right from burger. Oh. Is that to tell of, like, the correct way? It kind of makes me want to go the other ways. But at the same time... What about secrets, Billy? I can go back, it looks like. Ah, okay, good. It's just a trap. Let's see if I can go back. Probably not, because the game is like, oh, we told you. It's like, yes, but I don't know if it was like actually told me or if it was just like, I don't know how your secrets are planned. Secret plan. Steal your food, and they didn't seem to care. 
I steal their food, and they're just like, don't make eye contact. He's the Kirby man. He's been killing everybody. Yeah, they just do not care that I'm stealing their food. They know their place. Kirby, want food? Get out of the way. I don't know why they like, hey, spike. And they're like, hey, hey, fire. Ah, this must be a boss fight? I'll go fire. Ah, it's you! Wild, Mr. Frosty! I can just destroy the fun of this. Oh no! Hey, at least if I kill him, he wants to give me a hug! Okay, good. I am now the ice cream man. Garbage day. Kirby time. Kirby time. Natural disaster called Kirby. Oh. I can do that by tapping rapidly. purpose of that. Unless I was supposed to destroy the box before it fell down. Ah! That's probably it. It's probably it. Destroy the box before it falls down. Oh. Oh no. I was going to make a joke about it being dead, but no, it's just sleeping. And yeah, that capsule basically uh, confirms it was either a capsule I missed or something more important. Please don't see it. It's in one of these to their doom. Like that. Okay, good. <laughs> I was like, please don't fly off into the distance. <laughs> With the fucking Waddle D. <laughs> had mild fears that that's what he was going to do. Just roll off into the distance. Go left at K. We just keep finding all of these, huh? Oh! Uh, okay, I guess this is part of a missing map. And I just didn't, like, think anything of it. So yeah, left at cake and ice cream. Because there's two cakes. Okay, I get you now. Please don't, like, uh, be a trick. I'm excited to miss anything there. They have to be nice. They let me have their ice cream. Their ice cream cakes. If you just leave them there for a little bit, they get sad again. Like, oh yay, Kirby! And then Kirby's just sliding around, picking up coins. Kirby's just leaving me here. Eat four donuts. I don't think I'm gonna do that at the end of the day. Oh no. Excuse me. My ice! My ice! 
die. Ah, I thought we were gonna get ambushed. Oh, we're just gonna tear the entire wall down. Lol. I missed a decent amount. Well, there's gonna be a oh, wait. I think I see at least one more. It's gonna be up there. Along with probably the final donut. If they really want to joke me, it'll be two donuts. Well, there's one last donut. But why a gun? I don't know. I don't want to shoot you. It would be funny if it actually did go into the distance. Gun up here. Kirby games are predominantly freaking puzzle games at this point. So I missed one donut and a complete secret. Not too bad, I guess. Navigate the mall without getting lost. My secret wanting to find is the reason why I did not find secrets. Waddle Dee, these delightful residents of Planet Popstar landed in the new world before Kirby arrived. Things looked grim when the wild beasts began to capture them and steal their precious food. But with Kirby's help, they're rebuilding their town and starting over. Not really, we haven't gotten that far into the game yet. Ah, Elphalum! A mystical new friend you met in a mysterious new world. You found Elphalin as he was trying to save the Waddle Dees from the Beast Pack. He seems happy to be Kirby's guide, sharing helpful advice to save the Waddle Dees and rebuild their town. Thanks, Elphalin. Please don't become an elf villain. Poppy Bros Jr. <laughs> and now boss time? Yep, I just missed two. Sadness. We'll have to come back another time. <gasps> There's actually a Waddle Dee limit. That's hilarious. I wonder how many games journalists have cried out in vain. Are you going to invade? The Waddle Dee has helped you open the gate that's blocking your way. Head into the stage and challenge the boss that's guarding this territory. Ice Treasure Seeker! We will rock you by eating all your food. Freeze and fling. Oh no, I'm gonna have to freeze people and then fling their corpses. Okay, never mind. It's actually pretty nice. actually pretty nice. I guess these are kind of meant to kind of go into how the powers work. Like active tutorials in a way. I like them. Even if I had to restart the cone one over. Yeah. Oh, I, I thought it was 45 target. Ah, oh, I have hurt my soul. I am too slow for a Kirby game. But now we shall go. Beat up the brawl at the mall. Clear the stage and four mystery dealies. Oh no. Who do I need to shoot? Who needs to die? Yeah, this game kind of got harder the moment they introduced, uh, like, hey, don't do this, objectives.
Don't get lost in the mall. Ah, oh, there was a shadow. I was going to comment on the shadow. Wait, this kind of leading me. This makes me think there might be something to the left. No, it's just a hole. Dark. I thought it might be something, but it isn't. And now I'm sad. But now we have bananas. I kicked a rock, and a coin came out. Things are rumbling. I think I'll go bomb. Bomb spam. Bomb spam. That's the boss, isn't it? He looks like he's ready to kick my ass. Alpha Lin, you abandoned me. He's wearing a waddle dude. Strong armed beast. Goremando. I got grabbed, but I can get away. You can throw rocks, but you are not Donkey Kang. Lal. Elfelin, where are you? I've been slapped. <laughs> but I shall throw more bombs. We're jumping around. I have bombs. Sit down. There's a bomb. Die. I wonder if I wonder if I can save that Waddle Dee while in combat. Probably not, but we'll wait and see what the secret is. Damn. Bomb. Bomb. Your big. Fluffy forearms are going to be your doom. How are there four secrets? Let me guess. One of them is don't get hit. Bums, bums. Oh, he's going for a spin. Run for your life. Die! Bam! Oh no! Bam! Bam! I'm so used to contact damage that it almost felt like I can kind of get up on him and not have to worry about contact damage, only his attacks. Oh no! He's going for a spin! Help! Oh fuck! Ah! Kirby! That was an interesting fight compared to what I'm used to from Kirby. Fucking four secrets. Four secrets in that little area before this? We're gonna have we're, we're gonna see! Slip through his legs. And they only tell you one at a time. Oh no. Hey. I'm going to go back in. Never mind. We're leaving, apparently. Waddle D town, and then we'll go back and beat up Gorimondo multiple times. <laughs> and it depends on how many Waddle Dees you have that they can build things. The Waddle Dees are rebuilding their town, rebuilding in this new world. Save as many as you can, open up new buildings and helpful resources. Waddle Dee Cinema is now open. Rewatch some memorable scenes on the big screen. 
Want to gamble? Gotcha machine. The volume one is now available. Turn the crank to get a figure. Try to collect the whole set. Waddle D's weapon shop is now open. Head to here to make your copy abilities even stronger. Yeah, they already told me about that. Hey, Elfolin. Elfolin is so happy. Ah, oh, we found saved 35. I thought there was a way to, like, uh, say hello. Where's my say hello button? That's not the say hello button. I can say hello! Oh, look! Waddle D's weapon shop is open! Looks like a quick way to grab copy abilities! I also heard the Waddle D inside knows a secret to growing stronger! Let's pay him a visit! Sure thing! Welcome to Waddle Dee's Weapon Shop. I work with all types of copy abilities. It's kind of my thing. It's kind of my thing. I'm Kirby. Any copy abilities you find out there will become available in here. Pop in and grab one anytime. Oh, and guess what else? I can help you evolve those abilities to make them much stronger. This blueprint contains some incredible techniques. We can use it to evolve your abilities. Let's try evolving one right now. Already my tools. Thanks for waiting! The cutter ability can now be evolved into Chakram Cutter! Thanks for waiting! The fire ability can now be evolved into Volcano Fire! To evolve this copy ability, you'll need star coins and rare stones. You can find rare stones on the treasure roads hidden throughout the world map. Try those out. I prepped everything in advance this time, so we're all set. Just press A to evolve the ability. He gave me two of the rare stones. How did he get them? He's not Kirby. I shall evolve. The cutter ability has evolved into Chakram Cutter! Success! All done! The cutter ability has evolved into Chakram Cutter. If you find more blueprints, just bring them to me! I'll use them to evolve your abilities even further. Even further. I'll go ahead and evolve this as well. Hi. Evolve everything. Now this is actually cool. I don't think they've ever done this. Like the only thing similar to this is like uh, uh, Kirby and the Crystal Shards. Where you could combine copy abilities, but this is different. Give it. I'm gonna use this and I'm going to annihilate more Amongo. Okay, there seems to be a decent amount of potential. Ah, you can test out the abilities. Neat. Whoa. And then you can make it stay. That's cool. When you're ready to explore some new mo uh, some more, just hop on the warp star and fly to a new area. That's my. You think you know more about it than me? I flew across the galaxy once and blew up a star. Everbay Coast. You defeated the boss and opened up a new area. Abandoned beach. Well, screw you, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna walk through more of Mongo's legs. Like that. 
hidden thing alone has probably made some fan art exist. Take it! Take the chakra! And this is probably why they give you a billion bananas. So like, oh, you want to come in and do this boss again? Here. Bananas. Ah, wanted poster. That's probably... Nope. Maybe it's multiple wanted posters? Well, I want to look be on the lookout. Darn it, I lost my chakra. Fuck. I lost my chakra because I wanted to be like, maybe these question mark dealies must be annihilated. But there are multiple wanted posters that must be annihilated, apparently. Don't you hide? Accept your fate. Die. No jumping through broken glass. Here. Wanted poster, wanted poster. I'm looking for you, wanted posters. Not the way. Very ominous music. on the lookout. Uh, wanted the posters. Oh, I can actually... I don't think I was meant to come in there. Okay. Maybe I can go in this one. No. Darn it. Maybe there's a hit uh, wanted poster out there that I can blow up. I have been kidnapped again. That goal of Kirby. But I did it. wanted poster out here, even though there are multiple wanted posters inside. That made me think that getting rid of all the wanted posters would be a thing. Maybe at the end of the level. Maybe. I do not know. You can throw rocks all you want. Darn it. Throw rocks all you want. Not gonna say that. Okay, that's actually clever. They cover up the deloading of the uh, hole that he picked up the rock from by covering it with the rock itself. At least at that time they did. Let's see. I wanna see. So it's possible that it can if you run the right way. Of course, if you run the, uh, a different way, you're not going to actually get the same experience still. I found it neat in incidental cleverness. Maybe not all that incidental. So the game, it does kind of feel like it's encouraging you to run to the right. Let me guess, another one of the challenges is beat him without a copy of Ellie. That's probably more likely than don't get hit, but don't get hit's probably still a thing.
Oh, clear time? Huh. Well, at least I cleared two in the same run. So let's see. What's the next reveal to me? Because I'll, I'll gather, like, ones that I haven't done before. With the sword ability? Why that one specifically? That seems just an arbitrary. Like, slip through his legs, okay. A time limit, sure. Sword? Why sword specifically? Also, you know what would be cool? If you could actually use the coins to buy the hints. And be like, hey, how do I do this? And the game goes, hey. Give money, we tell. No, up the mall. No one will see it coming. I guess after the first hey, take down the wanted poster, they thought it would be too easy. Kirby, being two ninja at the mall. Mall ninjas, the worst kind. Oh no, Goramondo has kidnapped Link. I do like the title card intro. No, I got hit. It's hot. Get over here. I shall cut you in for bits. Sword! Sword! He can stop me with his thick thighs! Seriously, what is with this game? All the enemies being so thick, apparently. You will not be able to get me. I am all the way over here. Nile! Get to the monkey! He tried to stomp on me. I shall tell the mall manager how I feel on Yelp. I do not appreciate your mascot trying to kill me! His thighs jiggle. At least that time they did. Yeah, his thighs frickin' jiggle. Hilarious. The epitome of jiggle physics. And let me guess, the last one is either going to be no hit or no power. So let's see, no hit or no power. No hit or no power. Which shall be, Billy? Without taking any damage, I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it would be this one! I called it from the outset! <laughs> we shall clear the boss, slowly but surely. But at least this is setting a trend, so most of the bosses will be beat with a certain power-up underneath a certain time limit without taking damage. That will be, like, the main ones, and then a sp boss-specific interaction. Can't wait for Run Between Cat Lady's thighs. They're thick enough for it. Okay, but 
Take no damage. Take no damage. I remember. Take no damage. He walked while he while he was going forward and you walked into his foot. That hurt you. Bullshit, I say. If I have to play the game perfectly like that, take no damage, I expect perfection from your hitboxes. Granted, I could just go back and get the chakram and stay behind him eternally. Try that. We'll try that. See how that works. To Waddle D Town. I've only done 8%. Not bad, I'd say. But still. Have hard work. Want to take a look around? Sure. We have 42, so. Ah, so we unlock two buildings at 50. And I can only assume that the town will grow even bigger in the future. Give me Chakram. Now we have to go fight Gorimondo and not lose this. Like picking up one of the un... Like the non-moving freaking hats. Don't touch the non-moving hats. It's not that hard. Ah, 2007. A good year. Okay, but yeah... This way, I can stay behind him, but not have to worry about getting up on his booty. 2010, also a good year. The more it goes up, the less good it's gonna get, though. Hey, Goro Majima! I'm stretching your windows! How does that make you feel? Apparently not happy. Strong armed beast. Foster. Okay, good. Spin to win. More rocks. He's just a Kirby boss. He's gonna lunge! For a moment there, I thought he hit me with his snoot. Okay, good. Just more rocks.
go. Hopefully that counts as not getting hit. Please, to the love of God. For some reason, it really stresses me out. Yay! Now I don't have to play that level ever again. But hey, a, a kind of, uh, thanks to the new way that this Kirby is playing, it's nice and, uh, new. Because it just it doesn't feel like Kirby's done that before. Because he couldn't have camera angles. And all the Waddle Dees have been saved from them all. By beating them up in different ways. Adventures get me so excited, especially when if I, I'm with you, Kirby. Kirby's homoerotic adventure. So we have two things over here that we need to do to collect. Ah, so <laughs> they actually tells you how many uh, Waddle Dees are in this area. 43 of 46. And I guess we will do one more level. Ah, the ocean looks so beautiful. We should go for a swim while we're here. You're so happy-go-lucky. You're probably a monster. I'll just wander around, I guess. Find more hidden treasure roads. But we won't just do them. Normal treasure. Interesting. But we won't do them just yet because we're gonna do this first level. The Abandoned Beach. So, save hidden Waddle Dees, clear the stage, and three hidden. We'll do this, and then I think that'll be a nice stopping point. It'll give us a taste of what's to come after being... <laughs> after going through Goro Majima's legs. Ah, it's nice to see you. I don't know what your name is. Destroy the nut. Oh. Cracked open three knock-knock nuts. Well, at least I have the nut instructions. Let me guess, the game wants... What the hell? Is that Tiny the Dinosaur? Do we need to kill you? Can we kill you? Nope. He is non-negotiable. Oh! He really is non-negotiable. Indestructible giant dinosaur dude. I am a superior you. You think you can tell me what to do, Kibble Man? That sounds like a terrible superhero. Cable man. At the same time. Oh, of course the fish responds, but Sleepy Doodah doesn't. Sleepy Doodah is obviously going to be a challenge in this level. Suck up and use the absolutely useless sleep power-up. Or it's gonna be a joke and sleep power-up is actually going to be game breaker. One of these days they're gonna have to do that. Surprise! The sleep power-up is actually the strongest in the game. Then again, if there was a chance for that, it would have been, uh... Kirby and, uh... Kirby's Adventures in Dreamland. Because it would have been, haha, sleeping gives you dream powers. Hey, but Hammerman... Wow! You can take it off that there. Give 
me hammer. Hammer time! Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know. I, I just feel like. But hammer. Hammer! Aw. It looks like I could destroy that for some reason. Like a super hidden reason. What? Oh, you're so cute. Why do I have to kill you? Hammer, hammer, hammer. Hammer, 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 hammer. Hammer time. Take note. Oh, hey, it's these creepy guys. What are you going to look like in HD? Or do I have to actually try and suck on you? <laughs> Utterly horrified. Yep, that's you. You are not happy, man. I kill. What a bug man die. I don't know why I default to Arnold all of a sudden. Maybe it's because it's a bit easier on my voice than other voices like the Joker. Let go of my friend. He was hidden inside of a wall. Behind an even bigger wall. We cannot let that happen. Excavate my friend out of the wall. Oh, hey, it's a sand. Kill. Destroy the animal sculpture. I knew it. <laughs> it was like, cruelty is necessary. This cultural landmark must be destroyed. Die. What a bug, man. Uh, see an enemy, man. You have uh, Aquaman. See an enemy, man. Oh, let me guess I can climb these. You thought you were hidden. You are not. I discover your secret cave. I shall plunder your cave of wonders. Hopefully I'll be able to go back. I can. Yes. Okay, this looks like a time trial. It is. They let me know it's a time. Let me go. My friend's in danger. Stranger danger. My friend does not know that stranger, and he is in danger. The most dangerous of the stranger danger. No hanging on walls. I completely missed. I'm a failure. I wonder what your name is. Uh, surely you'll have a Funko Pop of your own in these gotcha bobbles. Help, 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 help. Jesus. Be gone, Satan. I can't destroy them all. Of course this is a mouthful. I am an O. I knew it! Complete the side! Friggin' knew it. Kirby is here to blow you away. Crocodile dudes looking at me. Real hungry like. Oh my god, guys. Boat time! It's the boat time! Wow, we could actually kill him. Get out of my way! Oh, you see where the boat goes! Potentially. Alright, I 
don't understand what that is. Wait, what? Where the hell was the the nut? What? All right, then. I guess let's go save the last hidden waddle dee. I assume is over here. Oh, what? Oh, we can kill the first guy. Yeah, I knew it. I'm gonna kill him all. What? Okay. Are you just unique? Did you not die? No, I was just hitting you improperly. No! Get out of here, Frosty. Frosty to show him in. Now back in the boat for more boat adventures. Go ahead and collect all these because we're going to want a lot of them. Just think of all the things I'll be able to buy. My gotcha bottles. I wonder how many upgrades there are in this game. Like how many of the... Bibbidi Bops actually have special upgrades to them that I can do. Don't worry, Giant O. Kirby is here to save the day. I did it. I destroyed the culture of this place. Made them all suffer. I got the cold! And bomb, Kirby! Bomb! Hold down the button to aim and throw. Got it? Hold, aim, throw. Throw, hit, boom. You can run and throw them too, or roll them ahead of you to get an explosive strike. I love this game already. This game, amazing. Concrete Isle. Sounds horrifying. And unlocks a new place to go. Lots of new unlocks. Yay. Wait. Shouldn't that put me over 50? Yeah. Two new buildings. Two new buildings. Oh. We have to see the buildings. What buildings are there to be? Now I kind of want to do another level just to get more of the last building. The 50 Waddle Dees you save work together to rebuild Waddle Dee liveries. Enter present codes to get special items. Kirby's house! You said work together to build Kirby's house. It's your home away from home. He's my home. Read book? Kirby doesn't know how to read. Really? Past adventures? Kirby Star Allies. Turn enemies into allies with friend hearts. Combine your pal's powers to invoke mighty friend abilities as you fight to save the world. Kirby Planet Robobot! I loved Robobot. I wish I could do it on stream, but it's, uh... A 3DS game, and the only way to do that for me would be to emulate it through, uh, Citra. Like, I own, like, a 3DS, I own the game, but I don't own a modded one to put it through, and it's annoying. Ah. I love Planet Robobot. One of these days, maybe. I wonder if you, like, can unlock different... Because this seems to just be like the modern era of Kirby games. Yeah, this just is the modern era, the Wii and up. I wonder if there will be like other books of like past adventures, past past adventures. Okay, I'm gonna have to get a fire ability. I'm gonna get a fire ability. 
And I'm gonna light my... my fireplace. I'm gonna light my fireplace. I love this. This is amazing. New stock! I just added the hammer ability. Enjoy! So far, this is an amazing Kirby game. I am loving this. What you saying, man? When the Waddle Dees were first being captured, I thought I would end up all alone again. But then I met you, Kirby, and you worked so hard to save everyone and rebuild this town. Thank you, Kirby. Thank you so much. You're gonna turn out to be the villain because at the end of the game, we're all gonna have to go home through the vortex again, back to Popstar, and you're gonna be like, no, don't leave me alone again. That is so what's gonna happen. To decorate your house of figures, just open up your collection with uh, minus. Then select the figure you want and press plus to display it. Really? You can display up to three figures at once. The best of friends, all together, here in the house. Adorable! I love that that's a thing. And that's probably a heel, too! Hey! If you need to rest, quick nap in this cute little house, ought to prick you right up. I love this. Hey there, this Waddle Deliveries. We bring you pre delivery presents right to your door. Just enter any present codes you find and we'll ship the related presents and drop them off by your house. Speaking of codes, there are a few present codes hidden right here in town. See if you can find them. Also, some present codes are shared through online announcements. So we can hop online to claim those. Want to see how it works? Sure you do. I hid a present code in the wall of the house across from us. Go check that wall to find it. All right, we'll look around. Any present codes you find in town can be entered and claimed offline. Pretty nifty, eh? Oh, wait. I would ask for this. Do you already have a present code you'd like to use? No. All right, let's see. Something. First password. <laughs> Hilarious. Yes. He actually brings out a pin. First. Password. That's hilarious. Aha, that code checks out. Your delivery present is already on its way. Look for it in front of your house. That is hilarious. Can I jump in? No, I cannot. But now I'm gonna have to be on the lookout for tons of codes in the town. A hundred star coins. Pretty decent, I'd say. Let me guess, this is gonna be one? No? Huh. What about this chair? Maybe if I sit in the chair? <laughs> you can sit in the chair! Hilarious. Gotcha Machine Alley. Pull the crank. Give me a bobble. Wow, we actually got a good one. Buffer Horn. Behold, it's the brutal, brutish Buffer Horn. Weak attacks won't stand a chance against this critter's forward tackle. Good thing they have a hard time stopping. If you're careful, you can trick them into running off cliffs. They'll be okay down there. They're real tough. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> you have to press it twice! 
<laughs> it's like, Kirby, are you sure you want to walk away from these brilliant deals? That's hilarious. What's the point of a chair? If I cannot sit on it to get things. Yeah, so far, loving this game. I think it is really, really good. It has all the core things of Kirby that I love so far. I'll definitely be playing it more in the future on stream, but I think that'll do it for now, because I don't want to go for too, 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 too long. Yeah, really, really good. The music as ever is fantastic. I didn't expect there to be a, a vocal music track to start the game off like that. That's pretty cool. The visual fidelity of the cutscenes is pretty cool, and the enemies and stuff. As usual for a Switch game, the anti-aliasing isn't the greatest, but hey, when you're actually playing the game, it's actually really good. And I think that's one thing that a lot of, like, graphic critics overlook. It's like, ah, the graphics, when I'm just looking at it, aren't that good. But then when you're, like, playing the game, it all bl So long as the graphics blend into a decent experience, I don't think it's all that bad. Graphics are meant to complement the game, and if when you're playing the game, the graphics look good. It doesn't really matter how much you, like, ah, anti-aliasing while you're standing still. It's like, ah, it's almost like that's not how the game's meant to be played. Where's, where's Kirby's 4K teeth? <laughs> but yeah, it's nice to see, like, Spike return. I forget if Spike was in the, or, like, his Spike ability was in the last game. I, my, time is an illusion, but yeah, the for, for the first boss fight against Goro Majima, it was very interesting to play. And, uh, like, for a first 3D, 3D Kirby. It was really interesting. And each level having, like, secret hidden bonus things is also pretty cool because... While I think, if I recall, Ultra Deluxe and Kirby Robobot had uh, hidden things in the levels. Like, oh, collect the three collectible things in the level. Here, there's, like, mini objectives as well as find the hidden... Waddle Dees. It's also nice to see the Waddle Dees not be enemies for once. Super cool. But yeah, I can't wait to see what other thick bosses they're gonna throw at us. Considering the trailer relieved re, re, of uh, the uh, brain. What is word? Revealed. I think her name is Clarina or something like that. And then again, Goro Majima. He's like Goromondo, I think his name was. For some reason, my brain is just like. Haha, ha, Maxor reference, and also kind of Goro Majima. Because Gore at the beginning of his name. I am Clev. But yeah, very fun. Music is great. Graphics are suitable to the game, I'd say. And a lovely hub town. Oh yeah, and you can upgrade the copy abilities. That's always fun. Always, always, always fun. But yeah, I do believe that will be it for now. Don't want to burn myself out. I might try and stream tomorrow. and But I will definitely try to stream on Friday. At what time? I do not know. Blah, blah. I really should get into the habit of making announcements on my Twitter. But then I'm like, ah, but then I have to monitor my Twitter at the end so I can delete the tweet so it doesn't clutter up my lovely forsaken Twitter page, ha. Huh? Yeah, this is a lovely game. I'm glad I got it for, well, I'm glad that my mom got it for my birthday. It was a very good game. Lovely, lovely. Oh yes, oh yes, thank you very much for watching. I've been Neon Icy Wings. If you want more from me, I have a YouTube channel that is edited content that I haven't uploaded to in a long time because life, and also a stream archive channel so that if you want to go back and see the various games I've played, like Undertale and Pokemon Crystal, you can go and see how I played those games. And uh, you can find those YouTube channels at Neon 
Icy Wings and Neon Icy Games, respectively. And then, if you want to see me watch these games... Oh, uh, yes, I shall watch these games and not play them. If you want to see me play these games live, like you people who are watching that there archive channel, you can watch me play these games live at twitch.tv Neon Icy Wings. And then if you also want to see my endeavors in making art, I try to upload... Uh, my throat! <laughs> That's another reason I need to stop, and my throat is giving out. But yes, if you want to see my endeavors in art, you can see me do upload such arts to Twitter, Newgrounds, DeviantArt, and Tumblr. All of them Neon Icy Wings, except for the Tumblr, which is Icy Wings Art Corner. But yes, but yes, but yes, thank you very much for watching. I hope to see you dudes next time. Bye, bye.